Good morning, Stampers. This is Michelle Suit from Suitably Stamp Studios. I am so excited to come, come to talk to you this morning, and I'm a little weary-eyed. No makeup, baseball cap, you know, I'm a little tired, but I was up late for a good reason last night. We went to the red carpet um, catalog premiere for Stampin' Up's brand new 2014-2015 catalog. Oh my gosh, what a great time we had. It was just so awesome being with um, my friends and my downline and just enjoying time together and coming home with a copy of the brand new catalog. So exciting. I'm going to show it to you in just a few minutes, so stay tuned. Um, there were over 7,000 demonstrators across the country and a few in Canada um, who were at different theaters around the country. Uh, with the Stampin' Up! team, they were in the, a theater out in Long Beach, California and doing a live uh, premiere event for us. And they showed projects and new stamps and accessories and oh my gosh, it is just going to be an amazing, amazing event having this catalog come out to you guys. June 1st, you guys are going to be able to get these in your hot little hands and you are going to love it. Unbelievable. I, they have gone above and beyond this year. Wow. Um, so we went last night and some of my anchor bells, as I said, went with me. My anchor bells are some of my downline team. And um, I gave them a little, let me show you what they got. This one was mine because I had to have one too. Um, got a little kit to, to uh, have with them last night at the premiere. See little anchor bell stampers. And it had their name on the front. And they had some uh, little post-it note uh tags to put in their new catalog and their wish list and a pen and some snacks and different things in there so they got one of these to take home and what um, they can use it for is when they go to create things uh, at a crop or bring them to our Inker Bells meetings they can put uh, any of their snips or tools or anything that they'd like to bring with them in this handy little case. And these are our wood mount stamp cases. And I don't know if you know, but we sell these um, in packs of four. And they are just awesome for all kinds of storage um, things. And I even saw when they first came out, Stampin' Up! did a video and somebody actually had packed their lunch in one. So these are really awesome. They are in the supply section in the catalog. So if you haven't seen them, you might want to check them out. Also, they come in half sizes, too. Um, I don't have one of those for you. Alrighty, so a couple things I want to talk to you about. It's just too much to uh, write down today, so I thought I'd do a video even though I look like this, so <laughs> hang with me. Um, I know I've mentioned Project Life to you on my blog and my Facebook page this week. Um, Project Life is going to be phenomenal. I can't even tell you how excited I am. I have boxes upon boxes of pictures that have been sitting. And I was an avid scrapbooker years ago. I All the bells and whistles. I don't know how many pages I've done. And a lot of those pages aren't even in books. They're still sitting in boxes because they weren't done. The thing I love about Becky Higgins, who created Project Life, her idea was capturing the everyday. So whether it's a pair of cute shoes or it's, you know, a cute outfit your kid put on or uh, a new puppy, like my first layout that I did, um, just celebrating the everyday and capturing those memories to share with your family and loved ones for years to come. So it is so quick and easy. I can't begin to tell you how rewarding it was to get that layout done just lickety split the other day with great products. Let me show you what um, I got in my pre-order and this was the first release. You're going to see this with several, several others uh, kits in the new catalog. So this is my Project Life, um, the pre-order kit that I ordered. This is called Everyday Adventure and your each uh, theme will come in a box like this, really cool gray, yellow, and white uh, boxes, really sturdy that you can keep your um, different uh, themed kits in or take them with you up to a crop or a meeting or wherever you're going to go and work on your pages. Um, but the boxes, when they open up, they uh, will hold the cards that are themed for the, this particular theme. Um, the uh, Pod Project Life, uh, if you don't know, they, these cards fit in clear pocket pages. And um, they're in different configurations on the different pages. So you can take them and do what you uh, would like for each type of pocket. You don't have to use pictures in all of them or cards in all of them. You can uh, pick and choose and cut them up and stamp on them and embellish them. They're really, really terrific. So um, in the kit you get the the large ones and two of the two sizes of the smaller ones. 
there are um, accessory kits that come with this theme too and they, those included things like clips and um, stickers and different things like that. Um, one of the things that your box will hold are the new Project Life journaling markers. These are phenomenal. I am not have not been, I won't say I am not, have not been a good journaler. Um, I would do a page and then I wouldn't journal on it and it was crazy. And one day my daughter Brittany and I were talking and I'm like, you know, it's kind of crazy, but I've re I read somewhere that people want to see what their great grandmother's handwriting looked like or, you know, having different things that are just jotted down there. It doesn't have to be perfect. It doesn't have to be typed out in a beautiful font. It's really special to see something um, that was written down. I found something the other day. Uh, it was a, actually a, a card that my husband had mailed to Brittany when she was two and a half um, when he was on a business trip. And seeing his handwriting to her when I knew that she was a baby at that time, it was just, it was so sweet. So be a journaler. Learn from me. I'm going to do it. <laughs> Um, one of the other project or products that is in the Project Lifeline um, is new framelits. Now you know if you have followed me, I love punch art, and I use my framelits for punch art too. So these are definitely going to be used for more than Project Life. They are great for cards. They're going to be great for 3D pro projects. Um, these are a really terrific set of framelits and really really easy to use. And again, you'll know that they are Project Life because they have that. Um, distinctive gray and yellow um, packaging. One of the other things in the Project Life line that I got were two of the new stamp sets. Um, this one is the months and days. This one's called Day to Day. Oh, that's a good name. Um, and they would be great for doing um, calendars or these are going to be great for the Project Life cards, but you can also use them for so much more. So don't just think of this as something you would be using in the scrapbook. Again, this is a great investment to use throughout your crafting. So, um, And this one is point and click. So this is really trendy right now because if you notice it has the word balloons, um, lots of arrows and the camera over here. You know with Instagram and everything these are really hot images right now so this is definitely going to be one that's going to be used a lot I am sure. Okay, um, I want to show you what I did with this month's paper pumpkin. I, um, I don't know if you have seen our paper pumpkin for this month and I am not coordinated enough to have all of it sitting here, but I'll show you what I did with mine. It had a Mother's Day type theme with a frame. I took my stamps and made something different. I made a Mother's Day gift. This is, oh, there we go. This is a little Mother's Day gift that I created using the Mother's Day stamp. Um, a little piece of tool I had sitting in a drawer. This is a, a glass from Dollar Tree. And it is holding a little, there's a little bag in there that has some vanilla bath salts in it. This is a little loofah with one of those hot little paper straws that are so hot right now. And I just punched out um, the little peony flower out of DSP and double backed that. And uh, added a little ice cream spoon in there and a little embellishment on top. And it's a perfect little Mother's Day gift because you can go and soak in your tub and enjoy it with a little beverage in your glass, beverage of your choice. So that's what I did with my paper pumpkin. All right, uh, let me show you my Inker Bells project for this month. Um, this is what we made at my Inker Bells downline meeting this month. And my Inker Bells are so awesome. Um, we get together once a month, um, and we try to once a month, and uh, create something together. We catch up on all the Stampin' Up! news and just really enjoy each other's company and it is a blast. And I will tell you that if you would like to be an Inker Bell, this is the perfect time. Um, well, let me show you their project first. The little box we made with the envelope punch board. You open it up and inside there are four little um, four by four gift cards and we used one of the retiring stamp sets so if you love this one better get it before it goes away so there's four little pocket or pocket cards sorry um, I am tired um, four little cards different occasions and then we made four little 
envelopes with our punch board and just a little pieces of DSP. Super simple, super easy to make. So there are matching envelopes and cards that all fit in your little box. So that's the project they got to make and take home with them this month at our Inkerbells meeting. Okay, so I was telling you that it is a great time to be in Inkerbell. It's a great time to be in Stampin' Up, period. May is phenomenal, but this May, it's even more amazing because the new catalog came out. If you join Stampin' Up just for the discount, just to get that discount on what you are already going to buy, you will be able to order $125 worth of Stampin' Up! product of your choice, including new stuff, the new Project Life stuff, the new blendabilities, new all kinds of things that are coming out in your starter kit. You can choose anything you like, $125 worth of product, and you pay $99. No shipping, no tax, nothing. You just pay $99. That gets you your discount for as long as you want it. On your first order, after you join Stampin' Up!, you will get 30% off that first order. And when you place an order of the first level of a workshop order of $150, you get another $25 in product for free. Anything you want. So, I know, you're probably sitting there saying, oh, but I don't want a business. I don't, that's okay. You don't have to make it a business. You take the opportunity and do with it what you want. That's what I did with mine, and now I'm working my business full time. But I started off doing it for the discount because I love Stampin' Up! So, if you join in May, you have until the end of September, that next quarter, to make your minimum. And it is completely doable. You will love it. There is never any pressure to stay if you decide you don't want to. Um, be a part of it anymore that's no problem you just say I'm done and they're like okay thank you so much and you're welcome back anytime they are phenomenal and there's never any pressure for me the thing that I love is I love being able to share what I love to do with everybody on my team and I love having my anchor bells over here and spoiling them so whether you're here local in Virginia or you're in California, you can still be an Anchor Bell and get the benefits long distance. So please contact me if you'd like more information. But I'm telling you, I am I am stoked about how exciting it is right now in May to become a Stampin' Up! demonstrator and to be an Anchor Bell. So please contact me if you'd like to and um, we can grow it together. All right, are you ready to see the catalog? Probably. I'll stop talking now and I'll show you the beautiful new Stampin' Up! catalog. This is the new 2014-2015 Stampin' Up! catalog. This is the cover and it's all I can show you right now. I'm sorry we're not allowed to show you the inside but what I want to tell you is if you want your own copy to be there soon, as soon as it can be, um, you can start ordering this cat out of this catalog on June 1st. Stampin' Up! demonstrators, you can pre-order starting May 1st. So there's a benefit to being a Stampin' Up! demonstrator. You can order a whole month early. So think about that too. Um, anyway, this catalog was going to go live June 1st and you are going to want to see this one. It's amazing. You will not believe all that's new in here. So um, email me, message me on Facebook, you can call me, whatever, but let me get you on the list so to make sure you get, you're going to get one of these. And I will tell you, when these catalogs go out, you're going to be receiving a special gift from me. So you won't want to miss that. So I am really sleepy, so I guess I'd better stop rambling for now. But I just wanted to talk to you today and share these things with you. And I hope you've enjoyed it. And uh, thanks for hanging out with me in a baseball cap and no makeup. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I wish you a wonderful day today. I hope you get to create something and get your fingers inky. Have a magical day, and we'll talk again soon. Thanks. Bye.